New research on the Great Lakes is going swimmingly at MSU. Grad students and professors are working on a robotic fish. As News 10's Ann Perrette reports, money from the National Science Foundation is helping them improve their design to stock certain fish. MSU's engineering department has been creating robotic fish for almost a decade, and a new million dollar grant from the National Science Foundation is helping them go one step further. The research team is creating a whole school of robo fish to track live fish in the Great Lakes. So when they're swimming around, they will, they will kind of beep, and then we'll have these robots to listen for these, um, for these sounds, and uh, then they will work collaboratively to figure out where the fish is or multiple fish are. The goal is to use the collected data to improve the Great Lakes ecosystem. Ultimately, you can use the information to improve the management of the fishery resources and practices, uh, and so we can help restore native species. We can help find finding ways to um, control invasive species. But it'll take four years until they see real results because they've got a few challenges ahead of them, like making sure the robots keep up with the speed of real fish. So we'll use a mathematical model to predict the location of fish in the future. So that allows the robotic fish to uh, kind of act ahead of time uh, to reconfigure themselves uh, to better track the movement of the fish in the future. And once that's figured out and the school of 10 robotic fish has been created, they'll take on Lake Huron's Thunder Bay. In Lansing, and Perrette, News 10. The project will also help improve drinking water by tracking algae in the Great Lakes.